Hey guys and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be starting a new let's play. It I'm probably going to do about quite a few levels on this. I'm going to try and get so that I finish all of them. But this is Bad Ice Cream 2. Um, this game is on Nitrome. I'm going to be doing a lot of let's plays on Nitrome because Nitrome is one of my favourite game websites. So you can go on it, it's got a lot of pixelated games. So yeah, let's get into it. Right, in a minute you'll see how to play and what you do. Right, I'm going to be, you can be all these kinds of ice cream. I'm going to be chocolate. Because I like chocolate. I've already done up to level 3, but I'll start at level 1 for you guys. Mm, yeah, I know. Right, so... You need to collect all the fruit using the arrow keys and space button to do that. And you also you can destroy ice. Right, so this is the first level, so if I die I'm going to be extremely embarrassed. But I doubt I will because I play this game all the time when I've got nothing else to do. Boom. That was pretty easy. Oh yeah, I forgot, I can just press space. I always forget that. This level's actually quite hard for level 2, because this warthog actually shoots ice. Yeah, as you can see now. It's actually quite surprising for level 2. So, anyway, so the whole idea is to get all the fruit and not get hit by ice, or by any of the moving other creatures, pretty much. So yeah, this is level 3, and I've gotten up to this level on this PC that I'm using now. I have gotten up to high levels. I think I've gotten up to level 20, I think it is, before, which is actually quite a high level for me. Boom. So I'm 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 pretty good at this game. This one is actually quite hard because it has these moving eyes that get in your way. So I'm actually doing quite well so far, having not died. I'm actually doing quite well. The best idea is to follow the ice right behind it. One of them. Ah. Uh, I hate it when there's moving fruits because it's really hard to get them and sometimes on certain levels they're so hard to get that you have to like go through more um oh I was hoping that the ice was going to stay still then but they actually go like into areas where you cannot actually reach them at all and they can stay there and I need to get one more he's staying here I'll get him yay so I'm pr I'm gonna do a let's play on this probably five episodes long, so not too long. So yeah, this um one you move s really slowly um around the edges, but you move fast when you go and see the other things. Oh yeah, I forgot to say cherries they teleport, so that's actually quite irritating. Oh, I think I got one. Yeah, but these en type of enemies only move up and down, so they're pretty much pointless. I doubt you'll be scared by these guys. <gasps> oh, Harry, shut up. <laughs> yeah, as you might have heard then, Harry is in the background, and he is playing a game that I used to play all the time. What's it called then, Moosh? I can't remember, because I used to play it all the time. Ends ball. Is oh, yeah, I remember. So, anyway... Yeah, you might be wondering why Harry's in like all of in the background of all of the videos so far. That's because I always record with him. Like right next to him are like PCs are right next to each other and stuff. So yeah. I think you've got an awesome lab. It's my um what's gonna call it? Called the lab of awesomeness. Oh no 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 no! Oh yes. 
smooth skills right there. That was smooth skills. We've actually got like a whole gaming setup, which is quite cool. Uh -huh, uh -huh. No. That's what I thought. What? Sucker. Oh, I can't get it. You can't get me. Oh dear. Start. <gasps> ah no, wrong way, wrong way. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? Oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. This is easy. This is easy. I should have gone this ages ago. Jeez. Oh, we started going around there now. You can just walk right behind them. Certain mobs don't follow you, but certain mobs do. And certain mobs are really overpowered. That they have like ice shooting. They follow you and everything. Like that warthog. However, he's quite easy to get past. The pairs on this level are quite easy to get because they're all in just one area. Quite a few um, things are like that. This is actually quite hard. Frost um, tiles, as you can see there, they re like generate ice over time, as you can see there. This guy is a real pain. He's quick as well. He's like school boys. He is, but he's irritating. He's one of the more overpowered kind of characters. And he's much cleverer. He's got um, a better... Ah, don't kill, kill me. I don't deserve to die. So, yeah. I'm probably going to finish this level and maybe the next one if I can oh yeah chilies are because they're hot they can melt ice you know when they're, they're hot when they you eat them so they melt ice which is kinda cool but it's kind of irritating because it means it's harder to get them especially on tiles that automatically like come back oh back off Yeah. Oh no, no ice. Wait, I'm gonna quickly have a look at the menu to see how far I've actually gotten with this. Let's have a look. So, space, and I'll just choose chocolate again, because chocolate rocks. I like the other one. I've gone up to level 8, so I think I'm gonna stop it there. No, I like that game. Hey, continue. I need it now. Fine, I'll continue until about 10 minutes. I hope you guys are enjoying this actually, but because Harry's forcing me to do this. Oh, this guy's annoying because he can fly on top of ice. And I think he like shoots ice or something, or sucks your brains out. Something weird like that. Oh yeah, he just, he sits down every now and then. Oh, please tell me that he freezes. Oh no. I was hoping he would like frozen because he would buy ice. But he doesn't. This guy's quite easy to trick though. And then you go. You gotta go one way and then another. And when they sit down, it's so easy to get the fruit, so. It's almost having like a free time where you can get fruit. Oh no, he's after me. Back off. Let me get the strawberry. It's funny when you die though. However, I don't want to die, so I don't want to show you what it looks like when you do die. But you're pretty much like a splat of ice cream on the floor. So, yeah. I don't want to die, though. I'm probably going to finish this. Oh, campfires. Yeah. You can put ice over them, and but then you can't really do much. They will burn the ice eventually, and when you destroy them, they will eventually reform. Like that. It's annoying that mob um, enemies don't die going over them. I know how to do this um, level. Game though. breaking glitch, Ryan's cheating. <laughs> shut up. It's not cheating, it's oh, just. Oh, so you're telling me to shut up. Ooh, this is getting personal. Headlock. Headlock. Get up with me. Anyway, so I'm gonna kill myself for you guys to show you what it looks like. Right, one of these mobs come after me. So yeah, it's quite funny, you just splat on the ground and then you're a puddle of ice cream and it's a 
total meltdown. I'm going to go back to the menu and so yeah. Look my score. I don't want to show you what my score is. My score is um oh no. Yeah. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, Stargate please um, <laughs> Stargate leave a like and if you want to see more then please subscribe. See you guys.